Well, hello guys, and here today on the Rusty Glove Box, we were able to get a little mini bike time in, kind of do a little repair, evaluate, and all of that. Got a few of my parts in, and uh, so I thought I'd just bring you over here and show you what we've done so far, so y'all come on. Well, we just have a collage of parts here. I got my brake lever, and uh, it's gonna work pretty good. With that, I got a uh, brake cable, and uh, it's more than long enough, and uh, so I'll be cutting it off some. Uh, Y'all saw the other twist grip, and this is the mate to it, and it fits the handlebars, so we're doing good. I got this, this is a little gauge. This gauge is a 36 volt gauge, and uh, it has little bar lights, you know, full, empty. I think I'll figure out when it's empty. This uh, is a power inverter. Takes 36 volts and converts it to 10. And uh, one of the guys suggested I use something like that. And so I looked it up and this thing's cheaper than a battery and it will also uh, carry up to 10 amps with 12 volts. So. Uh, this is going to be a, a good addition that I originally wasn't thinking about having eliminate a battery. This, I went to the harbor and uh, this is one of their disconnect switch and I thought this might be something interesting to put on there. Well, we got two brand new old tires on here. I bought these tires many years ago still has the sticker on it and uh, I got another one on the front and uh, 10 years ago when I bought these I guess they cost $12.99 because that's uh, what's on that sticker well this was one of the tires that came on the mini bike when I got it I'm gonna give this a try I'm probably gonna mess it up but it's uh, Chanute and it's Baltimore, Maryland, and uh, made in the USA. So that's back when they still made tires here. Well, some stuff that I wanted to bring up about this mini bike. Most mini bikes that I've seen, they have two down tubes. This one just has one, and it looks like it's always just had one. Nothing else has been welded in here. But here on the back, of course, it does have two, and then it loops around up here. Uh, but that was interesting, and this is what kind of throws me. I cannot find who built this mini bike with this single tube in the center. This was kind of interesting. It's, it's like it had a little glove box under the seat. I'm going to try to save this if I can because that will be a nice place to put the controller. And on this uh, voltage converter, I may be able to mount that up under the front here. We're just going to give you some measurements off of it. From the ground up, that's 20 inches to the top of the frame. And from axle to axle is 34 inches. And I'm gonna say about, about overall is 46. So that's a pretty small little mini bike, really. What I'm thinking about is that I'm gonna to try to get the alternator to fit kinda of in this area. I'm going to have the jack shaft and that pulley on that alternator, it's a three inch pulley. I have this pulley, which is a four inch. If I have the jack shaft go through, I possibly can use this little belt. Well guys, I tell you, we don't have just a whole bunch to show today, but we did get our tires on. 
and uh, I've got some odd and end parts that uh, I'm going to have to figure out how I'm going to mount the alternator on there and I need to get my jack shaft to come in and uh, we'll figure exactly where we have to mount the alternator. And uh, so anyway, I think things all in all, they're, they're coming together pretty good. So as always, I appreciate y'all coming by the shop today. This is Rusty Glove Box and I'm out here.